spend the rest of my life with the same one, same one. Ain't no I and T. I'ma bring you good love, just come with me. Baby, you're all the company I need. Hey, you guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your favorite girl, A. Marie. And today we're going to be doing a wholesale order plus packaging of some sample orders for a collab sale I'm in. I'm going to try to get this up. Yeah, I'm going to try to get this up on the day the collab sale starts so that you guys could get in on that sale. So we're going to go ahead and get off into it if you guys would like to see how I prep, make, and pack wholesale and orders wholesale orders and sample orders then just keep watching before we go any further i would love for you guys to like comment and subscribe click the notification bell and yeah comment down below what other entrepreneur videos you would like to see next this will be a talk through i believe i kind of want to do a talk through just so that you guys can kind of get the ordeal of what I'm going for or talk you guys through the process it will have music in some parts or it will be fast forwarded in some parts but for the most I am going to talk through it this is just the towel I use when making products I think I want to go ahead and I'm gonna have to pack the samples at the end because I've got my little ziploc bag but here's the box we're gonna be boxing the sample, uh, the wholesale order in. I did accidentally rip it, so I'm gonna use my tape, if I can find it now. I'm gonna use my tape to tape that box back together. Now, the first one is gonna be an easy one because this one is a already pre-made lip gloss. I have a mixer now, you guys. I do have a mixer, if you guys seen my what i got for christmas and my birthday video my mom bought me a very small hand mixer and it's a hand and stand mixer and i've been so excited to freaking use it my mom like invested in my business and i really really appreciate it and i really 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 want to use it but you guys this order that i have right now is way too small to use it so i would love for you guys to purchase some wholesale for me so that I could use my mixer on camera. I need a big wholesale order. Nobody has purchased red bottoms that I had pre-made already, so I am gonna use it for these five. My customer ordered five red bottom lip glosses, so I'm gonna go ahead and use this. So I ran out of spoons, so I'm gonna use these. <laughs> don't judge me, but I don't feel like using a real spoon to do this y'all i am not prepared i forgot scissors too okay i think i'm prepared so far so we are going to use a 60 ml going to use a 60 ml syringe i really hate to use these especially when the wholesale order is so small but there's nothing i could do about it so here's what red bottom looked like super freaking pretty and she smells like chocolate raspberry super freaking cute so my customer did also order the red bottom and mine so here is red bottom I already filled up in the tube here is Barbie another color that she ordered from me and also rave so you guys are gonna see me make all of these colors plus another one, Rave, and another one is a glow in a dark lip gloss. So you guys are gonna see me put that together as well. So like I said, because nobody has ordered this one, I am just gonna use, I am gonna use this just to make these instead of just mixing up a whole nother one and letting these go to waste. I hate for my product to go to waste because I'm not getting orders like talking about. This customer is a faithful customer. She has started her own business, but now I am her wholesaler, which is amazing. She started out as being a regular customer buying just from my 
line and then she decided her daughter decided she wanted to go into business so i am now her personal wholesaler taking a pipe in and i'm gonna cut off the ends i think i'm gonna put one more scoop in My lip glosses are very high shine, long lasting, smell wonderful. It hydrates your lips, vegan and cruelty free. Love that for me. So I placed the pipette on and before any of that product shoots out, I like to put it inside. She reminds me almost of a strawberry jelly. All bottles before they go out and before they're used, they are sanitized. Every time I get a shipment of tubes in, any product that I use and I get tubes in, like any containers, I automatically go ahead and sanitize them so they will be ready to go. She has five of each color. So here is five of the red bottom, like that. So the next color we're gonna make, we're gonna do this pink, and this is a glow in the dark shade, but she wants it red. So she told me red or pink, but she really wanted red. So I'm gonna go for a red. And I will show y'all what it looks like in the dark. So in order to make it red, I'm going to use the food coloring. And she's going to smell like strawberries. Before I mix the actual Versagel in there, I'm going to put a little bit of coconut oil in it. So that I can mix this up. So that the powder won't be... So the powder won't be um, powdery, like in chunks. But do you see how neon it is, you guys? It's so pretty. Super freaking pretty. Let's see if that works. The glow in the dark color is safe for lips, but on any edible lip gloss, I advise anybody not to eat the lip gloss. Just like, I know some people have like a issue. I don't know if it's an issue or like strange addiction to eating lip gloss, but I won't suggest eating lip gloss. <laughs> In every lip gloss, my own personal lip gloss or wholesale, I use Polyo, Polyes Butene, and this is the real thick one. They have a, like a liquidy one, but I like the real thick one. It lasts longer and it's real gunky, but it's great for a shine. It's great for shine. It's great to help make your lip gloss last. Oh, it is so good. I like to mix this in before putting my base in. So I do have my No Problem Versagel base. It's my favorite Versagel base. We're gonna take one and a half scoops. I'm 
I'm almost done with this one and I'm super excited because I want to buy another one. I want to buy another one, but I want to buy the 30 pound bucket. But my business is not that booming to buy a 30 pound bucket. The 30 pound bucket costs like, I think almost $500. So, gonna give myself some time for my business to grow before I buy the 30 pound bucket. But I do have to buy another bucket regardless. I hate to use spoons, but because I keep poking a hole in it, I'm gonna get the spoon. I'm gonna grab me a little bit more Versagil. And at this point, I'm over making now, which is gonna be a, a waste. But I'm gonna fill up some other tubes just to have it on standby, just in case. This color here is for my client's um, Valentine's collection. So this is gonna be really, really pretty for her. What she's looking like so far. Now we have the yellow, which is Rave, right here. And we're basically gonna do the same thing. Rave is gonna be infused with orange because all my glosses gotta have some type of scent, okay? It just won't be right if it doesn't. So here's the orange oil. Put a little bit of that in here if I could get it open. I know in my videos, someone told me they love to hear the rain in my background. Maybe I'll find some type of rain relaxing music to put in this video to enhance my rain sound. It is raining, it is freezing cold in Texas, finally. And when I say freezing cold, I mean in like 50, 40, 50 degrees. It was about to be bomb, you guys. I love Rave. Rave is my seasonal lip gloss. She's on clearance right now on my website if you guys would like to try her out. She's very cheap right now. I think she's like a buck. Only because she is my summer collection gloss. So that's the only time you guys will actually see her is during the summer. I'm not sure if my client is gonna use, my customer is gonna use hers for a certain collection. I don't know. I never ask, I just do what is asked. I love this polyopistine butene, but it is very sticky. Making lip gloss is very, very, very messy, you guys. Very messy but I love doing wholesale. I think I like 
doing my wholesales more than I like selling my own products. If it was my choice, I would wholesale all of the products that I make and only sell lashes in my line. I want to be a big wholesaler. And I wholesale body shimmer sprays, body oils, body scrubs, lip gloss, face scrubs, facial spray, like shimmer facial spray. I could wholesale anything you guys ask for. That's how my customer now gets me to do stuff like she would ask me if I know how to make a certain item. And if so, add it to the wholesale because she wants to buy it. <laughs> so that's how I came about with half of the products that I am wholesaling. She spends a lot of money with me. And she orders like every other week or two. She never, like that is my biggest customer. Love it. Okay, I have five. Boom, boom, boom. Same drill. I try my best not to have bubbles in my stuff, but sometimes it's just how lip gloss works. I made just the perfect amount for that one. I am going to give these a bath before I actually pack them up. Just so you guys will know, just in case if there's lip gloss on my hand or anything and it's getting on the tubes I will clean them up here's Barbie it's this bright 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 pink very neon pink I'm gonna take a little bit pour a little bit in there Mix this up, make sure there's no clumps. Y'all, Barbie is a badass neon color. Can y'all see that? Oh, Barbie is fire. I have Barbie in my web, on my website as well. And on my website, she's on clearance too because this is another one of my summer shades. So, if you guys would like to scoop her while she's on clearance, go ahead because she won't come back out until next summer. Oh my God. And she's not even showing up how popping she is on camera. So, Barbie will have Berry Berry scent. And this one is by the brand Get Suckered. Gonna put it. Bear Bear smells so good. She makes you want to eat her. So we're going to mix this in. Take a little bit of Polyus Butene. Just a little bit. And I only use a little bit because it's only five tubes. Is no reason to use a whole lot like this here to me is a whole lot for five tubes but I'll know that these all five tubes will be very high shine Now, because this one is pink, instead of me 
wasting another syringe. I am going to use the syringe that I used the other pink in. The one that I did the blue and the dark one in. So that I won't be wasteful. That's the great way to use these when our filling up orders. Filling up lip gloss. So that you won't be so wasteful. All right, and we're back. We are all washed up, ready to be dried off. Here is Barbie. I'm gonna take them all and wipe them down real good. We washed with Platinum Dawn Liquid Soap. That Platinum Dawn is great for breaking down Versagel. Here is the pink, glow in the dark. I wish it was brighter. Here is Rave. All right. And I'm just wiping them off and pairing them together. Here is Red Bottom. Red bottom is bloody, okay? So just to show you guys, the remainder of the lip gloss goes in containers like this. And these are considered samples. So you guys, we're gonna pack all of them up in this cutie right here. Let me not rip her any more than I did. I wanna bring her, yeah, right there for you guys. I do have pink tissue paper. I'm going to get a sheet of that. I do have this streamer paper stuff to <laughs> make it look cute. So that she's cute. Hopefully you guys can see that. And we're gonna line them up. Mm -hmm. Going in with Brave. Hopefully you guys could see that. I always feel like I do this backwards, so I'm going to take this all back out. <laughs> I'm going to take all this out because I feel like the bubble wraps should be on the bottom. So I am going to put a business card. Here's what my business cards look like. This is the back. Here's the front. Super freaking cute, right? And here is a Lavish Life sticker. Put that in there. We're going to fold her over. Gonna fold her in half. Fold her over again. I never can make tissue paper straight, but this will do. We're gonna take one of my Ambi Lavish stickers. I have the lime green ones. We're gonna 
put my sticker there. Boom, she looks like that. So I did grab my pre-filled lip gloss wholesale. This is what I put on every wholesale box, depending on what the item is. I do have pre-filled boxes. I mean, pre-filled labels that go on everything because you guys know Brandon is key. So this is what she looks like. And then I do have my two thank you cards. So since she did order these as well, I'm gonna make sure I got them correct. Here is her order slip over here. So she did get three red bottoms and I had two of these left cause she got the five ML. So I had two of these left and then a wand tube. So I'm giving her the wand tube in replacement of the third 5ml. And then she had the, she had two Rave in 5ml. So here is one in 5ml and then here's one in the 15ml. You guys, when I say they're on clearance, I just recounted inventory. <laughs> so that it could be right. So I gave her the 15 ml in replacement of the 5 ml. And the same thing with Barbie, she got two of them in 5 ml. So here's a 5, 5 ml. And then here is the one tube because I don't have any more 5 mls. She has 20 custom colors in the size 5 ml. She has 20 of them and they are $30. So, I got everything correct. What I want to do is I want to bubble wrap this, of course, like always. I always try to bubble wrap my wholesale orders. I don't care if they're squeeze tubes or what. I still try to bubble wrap them just to be on the safe side. So we're gonna flip it upside down. Gonna taper, and I always do this so that it is extra protected because I do not like hearing a customer say something came damaged, even though these are squeeze tubes. I still don't wanna hear it. <laughs> like, I don't wanna hear anything bad about my products and the way they shipped or the way they arrived. You know what I mean? I want to keep it calm, cool, collected, extra care for. And when you do this, I think customers really appreciate it no matter, you know, what it looks like. No matter what it is, I think customers really like the fact if you take extra good care of the product. In my opinion, if you are a customer and buy from places, do you like seeing your stuff extra packaged the correct way or, you know, no matter what it is? Or do you just rather, you know, a business to send it just the way it is? Like, so boom, all bubbled up the correct way. She's gonna go inside of here like that. Yes, it's extra long. I'm gonna put a sticker on here because that's just me. That is just how I like to do things. And these here are the ones that I messed up. So I like to pick and choose instead of just wasting it. I like to bring in everything so this is gonna go right here just like that can you guys see so we're gonna throw in both cards we're gonna put a little bit more shimmy shimmy like that 
my wholesale tape. Well, not my wholesale tape. I'm looking into getting wholesale tape, but this is my own branded tape. I will end it off with that. I like to tape it with regular tape first and then go on top with my label tape. Let's see if it'll fit in my poly mailers. Let's see if this box will fit. This is my own personal poly mailers, my branded poly mailers. So let's see if it'll fit in there. And if so, I won't have to send it in this big old box. Okay, so like I was saying, for my sample order, I am gonna use these ugly mailers. I always use these ugly mailers when it's basically a free order. Um, I'm gonna send her 15 samples. And I decided I'm going to send my birthday cake lip scrub samples. So with the birthday cake lip scrub samples for my sample order, this is another black owned business I'm sending it to. So I'm sending her all three of my different thank you cards. Here is our standard thank you card that looks like this. Here is our holiday thank you card with a coupon code. These expire February. That's the reason why I'm sending it. And then here is our a and B lavish flyer and it also has a coupon code all three of them have coupon codes on it and my own my shop owner that i'm sending it to she can use all three codes if she shall like they're for her so we're gonna sit those to the side now with the scrubs i'm gonna send i want to send them in this plastic bag and I want to see if 16 will fit because it's going to be, I'm sending her 15 samples and then an extra one for herself. Okay, that's 16. I brought another bag just in case. Hopefully these all will fit. Almost, you guys. It almost fit. Almost. And it looks so pretty in there. I do already have my stickers, my labels on it. So this is what one looks like. Super freaking cute, right? Just like that. And since I got that extra space, I'm going to slide this in here. Since I have this extra space, I am going to take 15, 16 of these. I got my stickers made from Sticker Mule, and these are die cut, kiss cut, whatever you would like to call it, stickers. And they just say Lavish Life. I also have some that say A and B Lavish on it. We're going to fit those in there. Boom, just like that. And then I'm going to send 16 business cards. I am going to write a note to her so I won't seal it, but she will slide in here this way. I'm putting her long ways so she could fit as flat as possible. Slide these in there like that. And she will go flat like that. These go in my packaging drawer. But I have all these different types of labels. I have the squeeze tube wholesale. I have just regular A and B lavish. These are for my clothing pieces. Like you guys, I'm dead serious. This is my lip gloss, I mean my lip scrub wholesale. This is my pre-filled jars. 
This is for my lip gloss starter kits. Y'all, I be on it. Here's the lip gloss um, pre-fill gloss jars. I have it all. For the wand tubes, the growth serum wholesale. I have it all, okay, you guys? So we are gonna place this right here. Gonna put that smack dab in the middle. We are gonna seal her up once I actually write her notes. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video of wholesale packaging plus making the order. <laughs> hopefully you guys like this entrepreneur vlog, not vlog, video. Hopefully you guys hit the subscribe button as well as the notification and like this video. Um, if you guys want to see any more videos, let me know down below what video would you like to see next. And I will try to do it, especially if it's entrepreneur videos. Let me know your suggestions and your ideas because I haven't really been uploading any entrepreneur vlogs or videos because I haven't been getting sales. So I haven't had nothing to record, but... If you guys have any ideas of anything for me to bring to you guys, let me know. As well as if there's any other video suggestion for my for beauty videos, let your girl know and I will get it done for you. Thank y'all so much for watching and I will catch y'all in the next, next one. Deuces. Trying to spend the rest of my life with a